Hello, YouTube community, and other people watching this. And you'll notice we're back in FRD lands in Minecraft. Well, as you can tell, if you've ever been in, if you've been in the server lately, the FRD was disbanded. It went through a pretty massive civil war, and there isn't much damage to the infrastructure, as you can see, because no one really used TNT all that much. And we weren't stupid enough to make buildings out of wood, except for up there, and then it didn't burn it down for whatever reason. But... The, yeah, the CFRD has gone through a pretty massive civil war. A lot of things were lost in this war. But the faction was disbanded now, and regardless to belief of some people, I'm not going to leave the server necessarily. Like, as stop playing on it, I'll be playing on it. I'm gonna form up a new faction. But what happened with the FRD is there was a first of fascist succession, or secession of the fascist party, taking a lot of land in the north up there. They call themselves the Nether. They basically rebelled and started their own faction, and there were skirmishes over there. I believe there's still the trenches dug from the fighting. Or there were trenches being dug in preparation for fighting around their territory. And someone decided to build a wall there. And then the communists started an insurrection. So we basically had the both of the political left and right trying to rebel. And as you can see, the communist hotel was probably the only area in the FRD that took any infrastructure damage. Besides whatever the hell went down in Waffles, uh. little, uh... Waffles where the Waffle the Bard built a rail line here. I don't think he was connected to the insurrection whatsoever. As you can see, there were some the communists were also stockpiling all the supplies. They were stealing everything and stockpiling it to start their own faction in the hotel. Well, we launched a preempt with a preemptive strike, we destroyed the communist hotel along with the supplies. Unfortunately, the hotel has pretty much been destroyed in the process. As you can see, the farm took a few hits. The farm was pretty much burned to the ground, or all the stuff was taken from it. It was harvested and never replanted. I don't think the residential district saw any fighting. There was some fighting in the Capitol building, and we largely just abandoned it, and people came in and, uh, I think looted the chests. Yeah came in and looted the chests. The Capitol building really hasn't taken any real damage. I think there's just a few broken glass blocks, but that's it. The rest of it's largely intact. So we have to make a decision either to stay here and reform another faction in FRD lands, or to completely abandon the idea and go to new land. But I'll make another faction. I'll actually allow a small percentage of any of my viewers who watch my Minecraft videos. I'll allow another vote on this. Whether or not I should continue to play this Minecraft server. Actually, I'm going to continue to play this Minecraft server. I don't know what I said, but what I meant to say was whether or not I should form up a new faction. Because I'll allow people to become a part of it as was the plan with the FRD before the Massive Rebellion. See, when I make political parties, I gotta draft a constitution pretty quickly. And I think I was a little bit delayed on that, and that's what cost the FRD their, uh, its pretty much existence. We're established here, but there is the nether that still exists up there. And I don't think Lord H. Chance, who's leading the other faction and led the rebellion and the, led the opposing side in the Civil War. He's also the person that was, along with Spat and Killer117, who started the war that destroyed the HRE before. I don't think I'll ever show you old HRD, HRE lands. I kind of called the HRD, but it's HRE, Holy Roman Empire. Yes, I can go reclaim this. I don't know, I might end up doing that later. Maybe. But I'll leave a uh, vote to decide. 
And also, if you comment in the saying, either vote yes or no for a new faction, and preferably what government type it should be. Because I'm trying to do a role play type of government. I was trying to do a democracy with this, but we never made it to the elections for one reason or another. And, uh, as I said below, just comment saying either no, don't start another faction, or yes, start another faction. And I'm also going to try to give you regular updates on what's been, on what happens with it, as well as probably just straight up gameplay of stuff being built in it. And also, what should it be? Should it be like a socialist government? I'm not going to go the fascist route because I just, because I know I'm already, my natural enemy is probably going to end up being Lord H. Chance in his little fascist empire that seems to always pop up no matter what I do. Or... Should I try another democracy or should I try this little... I don't know, should I just try to build a commune or... Because I'm going to go with building another city obviously, but we're going to have certain viewers we're gonna have view. We're gonna enable basically viewers for voting on what's happening in the next like building projects, because I find it a lot more interesting that way. I think it's interest more interesting for everybody as a whole. But and also, should we build in this old FRD land and claim the already existing buildings? Probably fighting chance in the process, but I'm fairly sure with the combined help of you, the viewers, plus anyone else I can conscript. We can beat him back the second time. No, we're not as prepared as he is. Or we can get on our boats once again and as political exiles, go find an island somewhere and rebuild our little empire. Or not empire, just build our new faction slash nation. I treat factions more like they're nations, so that's just me. Okay, as I said, comment below, comment with all that. And this is the Max signing off.